Welcome everybody, this is a Day Trader Genius Daily Stock Option Review for the 14th of March, 2019. I'm your host, Scott Patton, joining us is Coach Jay. Our goal is to show you that even on days, as you can see, like today, which is basically uh, the doldrums, you know, there's no wind blowing for your sailboat to move or there's nothing happening, there still are opportunities for you to make money with stock options. And that's our goal is to show you pretty much every day Monday to Thursday, you can make money trading stock options. If you have the right tools, if you have the right knowledge, if you have the right education, if you have the right coaching, uh, there's a lot of things that need to come together. You don't master something overnight. You need to practice. You need to put the work into it. So it is a commitment. You know, we all, all us guys hate that C word, but that's just the way it is. Can't get around it. However, just imagine where you can, you know, Get in and then check your uh, stocks in the morning and by the noon, you're ready to go and enjoy the rest of the day. It's a lot better than commuting to and from work for a couple hours and then having to work for a boss and having coworkers that you have uh, no say in who they are, blah, 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 blah. You know the old 40-year 40, 40 plan is not working anymore and you need to either have this as a side hustle business or you need to have it as a replacement for your income. And of course, we're here to support you in either of those cases. So, Coach Jay, it looks like there's an area in the Pacific where if you're sailing, there is never any wind and you just sort of sit there. Today looks like that day. Pretty sure we should just pack it in because there's no opportunity. Am I right? Well, you're, you're definitely right about it not having a lot of wind behind its sails. That's for sure. But there are a couple of opportunities. This is looking at the basket. Yes. <laughs> this is looking at the basket overall. So we're looking at a collection of about 20 stocks making up this uh, chart here. And yeah, we just channel all day between opening price and 945 top with a little peek out here and there. But lucky for us, we don't always have to rely just solely on the market. We can, with training, with some coaching, you can identify some good runners and take advantage of those opportunities. So even when the market as a whole is struggling, there's still sometimes opportunities within individual stocks. And that's what we're going to take a look at here. We are going to go to the beginning of the day. It's going to be bright and early. We're going to be in and out so we don't have to watch. This is like watching the stock market on a day like today is like watching an infomercial, you know, over and over and over. There's just <laughs> nothing's really happening. Nothing's exciting. So let's get in, get out and call it a day. Let's get there. Just went to one minute candles and went back to the beginning of the day and looking at LRCX. LRCX just has some moments where LAM research, it just takes off and is uh, a nice cool drink of water on a really dry day when you're in the middle of the desert. <laughs> Gets you some opportunity. Here we go. We're going to buy a call now. We're breaking resistance, which is exciting. It's coming off. We've got this uh, fantastic blue star. And let's go ahead and jump in. We've got background coming on. We've got signals strengthening. And right there, we've got a decent length of trend. And for me in my process, and you guys can't see the whole market right now, but we saw the basket overall. so expectations should be pretty I don't want to say yeah yeah we'll say we'll say low and, and the market also so kind of get red, in get so. out yeah the market's just it's just not it's it's in this no man's land uh, in other words not choosing a direction so get in get out and be done with it and so we'll close that one out I think it might, well, we'll see what it does. I'm not sure. Yep, it keeps going. Lamb Research is uh, having a mind of its own. Look at this trend. It's just an wow. impressive trend. wonder, I'm going to scroll forward. We're going to, there we go. So it goes all the way up to RC. That's fantastic for my process. That's enough, whatever that closed at, 20% or whatever it was. Yeah, I think it was 24%. Yeah, so you could you could have squeezed out a couple more percent, but you're you know you're kind of 
when you're in a day where obviously very little is happening and you've got 24%, there's a good chance that you're going to lose it quickly. So we want to minimize the risk. <clears throat> People talk about stocks and options as being very risky and uh, they're risky when you're greedy and they're risky when you're fearful and they're not risky when you have predefined in entries and exits. In other words, you know, if it hits something like this, I'm going to get out, you get out, it makes a little bit more, well, good for it, doesn't matter, your wallet is safe and, and secure. Yeah, one of the other things on here is the volume spike and the distance it's moved. It's already moved 112% of its daily average range by this point. So, it, so in other words, it's moved as much as it normally moves. So, you know, based on that, it's kind of like, well, now you're starting to get risky. Now it's, you know, the tension is ramping up and we like to be as stress-free as we can when it comes to trading. If you like, you know, drama and all that sort of stuff, you know, go parachute uh, jumping or paragliding or, uh, you know, swim with sharks. Do that on your own time. Don't do it when you're, you know, playing with your money and your livelihood. Yeah, this is a business, like you said in the beginning. This is a business here. We want to run it like one, and we don't want to be irresponsible with that business. Cautiously optimistic, but when the indicators are there or you feel like something's gone on long enough, there, there's a reason for that. So this usually takes the entire day. This is the average daily range, and it did it in uh, six minutes. Did it in five minutes, really. So... <laughs> Let's not push it. Let's just say thank you and move on. That's we right. don't, we have the benefit in, in this setting to have the, the foresight for the day. And we don't have that trading this live. We can, you know, so I don't want to pull that into the discussion, but also look at what the day's shaking up to be. And if the day's shaking up to be a not so exciting day or, or not so uh, fruitful day, then man, do one trade. Call it good. There's yeah. no point in increasing the risk if, if you don't have the discipline to stay out and just watch it. Yeah. All right. So was there anything else that happened today? There was. Our good friend Lamb Research decided to continue a little bit later. And I love these days when this thing is just moving and it's saying to heck with the market. I'm taking off whatever it is. They've got a new product, got some new investors. I, who knows what it is? So we're just going to be the lion in the grass at the watering hole. We see this setup. The setup is beautiful. And just waiting for it to pop its head through. Right here, we're sitting at a new high. And let's get in. And we're reaching, we have maxed out our ceiling somewhere in here since we're, for uh, example's sake, we're going through minute by minute, but playing this out, I would be out in somewhere in this zone. We got the seven day break above, we've got RD, we got a, uh, not a whole dollar amount, but you know, another dollar amount here that this is going to provide some resistance. So we'll go ahead and exit with that. And for today, let's be done. We saw what the day looks like. Let's not increase our risk more and more. Just by being in the market on a day like today is, is not without its own pitfalls. And so we'll be done by you know 9.52 in the morning, shut the computer, not have to watch the same infomercial over and over and over again on a day that's not moving. That's right. So the same stock, we got in, we got out, we got in, we got out, we made 24% uh, and 14%, and one was in three minutes and one was in six minutes, so well over 10% in 10 minutes of trading. Now, you would have been around a little bit longer than that for sure, but not, not much. I mean, if you've taken the first uh, half hour of the day and you've made some money, uh, you can take you know the trading day, which starts at 9.30 you can enjoy the rest of the day. And that's what this is about. This is about giving you the, pardon me, financial freedom to live the life that you want to live. And uh, all you need to do is practice. We've got a 10-day free trial, so you can use the replay. 
We've got coaching for you. We've got training for you. We have everything you need to be able to practice and master this. It takes time. It takes commitment. It takes perseverance. It takes coaching because most of us have problems with our mindset when it comes to you know being successful. It's kind of like the financial thermostat is set for a certain amount. And you see this in traders all the time, right? Like, oh my goodness, I just made, you know, a hundred thousand dollars on trades. And then, you know, you talk to them a week later and it's, well, I, I lost 90,000 because they're comfortable with 10. And so that's not something that you can usually go through yourself. There are of course always exceptions, but most people, they need help changing that financial thermostat so that they're able to accept the wealth that the world has for us. These financial instruments are just sitting there waiting to give you money. And uh, you just have to you know, step up to the plate and uh, learn the game and play it. Yeah, good point, Scott. The coaching helps speed up that retooling of your financial thermostat. People can absolutely do it, but they tend to pay a lot of tuition in the process. In other words, a lot of money goes out of their trading account to whoever else has their uh, financial thermostat a little bit more dialed in or, or to it, set to a different degree. Yeah. So we can really help speed up or accelerate that process for success in the market. One of my coaches used to say, we can't take our eyeballs out, turn them around and see ourselves. And so we don't. But when you have a coach, the coach, it's really obvious. Oh, you know, Scott, you always do this. And once you're aware of a behavior, you can do something about it. And when you're unaware that you're always whatever it is that causes your problem, then it won't change. But once your coach says, you know what, when you get in this situation and you've made your 15%, you always hang on until you're down to 1%. So let's make a new rule. Let's make a new change. And it's like, oh, really? I do that? And you can be even, you know, journaling it all the time and probably still would miss it, right? Because we have blind spots. And that's the value of a coach. So we have some training. We have an opportunity for you to get in, you know, commit to 10 days of really focused effort when you get in. There's nothing worse than someone getting on the 10-day free trial and day 11 deciding they're going to get started. So we want to make sure that you're really ready to go. And then we're here to support you. So uh, description has a little bit more of the details where you can find out more about us. And we look forward to working with you. So thank you, Coach Jay, for sharing your uh, expertise with us today. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.